Stuart, how often do you believe it's necessary for an organisation to provide travel safety training? Well, well, the good thing is I think most people understand now that they need to provide travel safety training for, for their employees when they travel. And we've moved from the face-to-face -to, -face to the e-learning to the video base. There's lots of different ways to do it. But I think this is evolving again. And it's not every year or every six months we sit and we, we undertake the training. With the, the applications that we have now where you can just watch a video, if you're about to get on a flight, you can learn how, how do I stay safe by getting on that flight. You don't need to watch a whole series of videos and understand what it's like for travel on boats. You only need to watch what's relevant and you can keep dipping in and dipping out. It, it's, it's training on demand. So if you're about to get a taxi or you're traveling to a country that you're not sure about, find out how to research that country. You can watch it on your mobile phone and you can just pick it up as you go. So I think a continual learning for what is relevant for each trip and it will always improve uh, what, what you take in. Uh, I think it's under something like 80% is, uh, is lost after the first month of training. So why train once a year or twice a year? Have a continuous dipping in, dipping out and technology allows us to do this now.